People, this is Kaz Ramarinu, and I want to leave a quick message with you. Uh, I was just thinking about some of the things that have allowed me to do what I'm here to do today. I probably shouldn't be here, shouldn't be alive, or possibly in jail. Uh, many of my family members, mom, dad, uncles, cousins are not here. Maybe some of them are, uh, you know, confined, locked up, basically. And I possibly, sh uh, I shouldn't be here. And, you know, I just thought about it. And although I, I wasn't raised in a, a well-to-do family, we didn't have a, a ton of money. Hey, police cars out there. Uh, we didn't have a ton of money. Um, I definitely wasn't raised around the wealthy or the, you know, the, you know, the Bilderbergers, so to speak. Um, when I grew up, I um, graduated from college, finally, after taking five years to finish high school, I still wasn't around any affluent circles. You know, I didn't have any mentors per se, but the thing I thought about that has really helped me out a lot is that the people who I grew up around, they weren't like highly educated. I don't even know who had a degree or not, to be honest with you. I'm pretty sure many of them did not have a degree, but there are certain, you know, they always say survival of the fittest, at least that's the Western view, the survival of the fittest, only the strong survive. Well, I was probably the weakest, literally. I was a puny little guy, light-skinned. I did have curly hair, believe it or not. And, you know, in the inner city, that could be rough. You know, you really have to prove yourself, no matter what complexion you are, but you really do have to prove yourself. And if you're a pretty boy, it could be pretty freaking tough for you. So I uh, grew up in a uh, super, super, um, you know, rough area, Detroit, Michigan. And many of the principals... Uh, like morals, ethics, um, you know, believe it or not, you know, some good religious beliefs, um, and just constantly watching over me and protecting me because I wasn't the strongest guy. Those are some of the things that helped me to be who I am today and uh, also to keep uh, strong ethics as a result of that. And I'm thankful for that. And I think many times we don't give those people in, in our communities that have helped make us who we are credit because it's not directly correlated to our current success. But believe me, it means a lot. And if you are now in a position um, where you can be a, a shining example or provide some level of guidance, then that's a great opportunity for you. Um, and it would definitely have an impact. So don't think because you know, you're know you not on TV, or you don't have this popular name, or you're not some big star on social media or whatever, that you can't impact. It definitely has an impact, and I thank everyone out there who helped me to be who I am today. Be good.